Hello, Jenny here from Midlothian Libraries. Today we're going to make a caterpillar. So we start with a white piece of card or heavy paper. Take something to draw around. You don't want it to be too big. Um, something that will fit maybe eight circles on the one page. I've used an empty jar and you draw, as you see, eight circles on your piece of card. Then we're going to get some paint and I've used poster paints in this instance and I've got six colours. can't quite see because they're off screen a little, but six colours, a large brush and start painting. I'm using the brush and I'm mixing the colours and I'm not cleaning the brush too much in between because I want the colours to mix. like this until all eight of your circles are coloured. And this is the last one. And then you put your colours aside to dry. These are ones that I did earlier. And I'm now going to cut them out. So, because I've used a fine pen to draw my lines, I can still see them through the paint. If you're using pencil, you might want to use a heavy weight of pencil rather than a, a fine one that is hard to see through the paint. And you cut out all eight of your circles. then going to mark each of the circles with a dot where I want to cut a hole to fasten the circles together. I'm just deciding which circles go where and then I'm just going to mark each place with a dot. Your head will only need one dot and so will the tail, but each of the other circles need a dot on either side. Now I'm going to use a hole punch, which I've taken the bottom off, so I can see exactly where to position the hole punch over the dot, so I know that I'm cutting out the right place. I don't want my hole to be too close to the edge um, and I'm just making sure that it's they're lining up. And you carry on doing that with all your circles until you get to the last one and as I say it has only one hole. Now you're going to take your paper fasteners they go through the hole and they open out at the back so I put them into the first hole and then join it onto the first of the sections and open out the two metal prongs and that fastens the two together and you carry on doing that until all the pieces of your caterpillar are joined together So 
the last one. Now we're going to give the caterpillar a face. And I've got a couple of googly eyes. pom pom for the nose. You can just as easily draw the nose or cut out some um, coloured card or um, yeah, the same with the eyes. You could draw the eyes on if you don't have googly eyes. Um, but just whatever face, whatever you can use to make a face for your caterpillar. a felt tip pen or marker to draw a mouth. that I'm going to use um, a bit of pipe cleaner. little glue on PVA glue on the pipe cleaners and stick them to the back of your caterpillar's head and that is your caterpillar I hope you enjoy making one too